All right, guys, I'm going to make steak and chicken fajitas. And what I'm going to do is um, I got this meat marinade. I'm going to put this in a bag with this marinade sauce. And what it calls for you for is one package of the season and mix. This is good for three pounds of meat. That's only one pound, but that's good. I ain't got a problem with that. It calls for a quarter cup of oil, um, quarter cup of oil, two tablespoons of vinegar, and one tablespoon of water. Well, I'm going to use the Italian... It's got all the stuff I need in there. I'm going to use that as the juice. Oh, yeah. Oh, real work I'm in, cook, mama. Oh, yeah. That's what we're going to use. So I'll mix this with this in a bowl, and then we'll put it in that bag, and we'll, we'll marinate it. stuff to my marinade. I'm gonna kick it up mama. Little pepper in there. A little dog we'll put some of that little doggy salt in there. Oh yeah. And the steak, you gotta put steak seasoning in there. Oh yeah mama. Alright we'll put some of this Italian dressing in there. Can't do that. It ain't gonna work. Oh yeah, it will. Do a hell of a marinade. Can't do it. Can't do it. Can't be done, Mama. Oh. Get it, man. Oh yeah. We'll put that in a put that in a Ziploc bag. Put that in there, and boom. All right, guys. Before I put the meat in there, I'm going to rinse it off in the water. Let me give it a little rinse. Guys, I rinsed off the meat really good in the water. Whenever you buy anything from a store, you really should rinse it good. Because you don't know. Alright, let's try another bag. Hopefully this one's in better shape. Yeah, this is in better shape. Put the steaks in there. We'll put our marinade in there. Air out of it. And I'll put that in the refrigerator. I'll put that in the refrigerator for a while and I'll marinate just like that. Oh yeah. That's gonna be yummy, mama. How real work I'm in cook, man. I could marinate the chicken, but I'm just gonna marinate the steak. It's gonna be fajitas. Alright guys, so I got my meat here going in the marinade like we, like I showed you before. Been soaking for, you know, an hour or so in the marinade, the meat. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the chicken in the oven here. I'm not going to use all this chicken and, you know, I'm going to be doing fajitas. I've got the uh, tortillas here. Green bell peppers, red bell peppers, and onions. And I got this Mexican mix, it's like, you know, four cheese blend. So we'll get some of this chicken. I'm not going to put it all. I'll probably, you know, do four or so. I got this stuff pretty cheap, like 88 cents a pound or something like that. Yeah, 88 cents a pound. So I'll probably take, you know, maybe, maybe half. I'll take five of them. And I'll put them, bake them in the oven. We'll get them all ready to rock and roll. We'll get them all cooked and... Um, then I'll try to bring you guys along for the video. It, you know, tortillas is basically just, you know, green 
peppers, red peppers, onions, and uh, you know meat. Once we cook it up, now I'll, I'll kind of you know put these in the oven and brown them up a little bit, and you know I'll, I'll get some sauce together for it, and I'll try to bring you guys along with a video. So let me get this rock and rolling in the oven here, and we'll bring you along. All right, guys. So I just just put the chicken five pieces in there, and we're gonna bake them to their crisp poultry seasoning. That's all I basically put on that. And I'm going to leave the skin on it, so, you know, hold the moisture in there. We're just going to bake them until the chicken's done. You know, and then once the chicken's done, we'll do the steak. We'll get that all rendered down. And and um, I'll bring you guys along how I do these tortillas. It's, hopefully the video's not too long. Anyway, guys, the chicken's looking pretty good there, so I'll probably pull that out and get that ready to go. Alright, so I've got my green peppers, red peppers, and onions all cut up. And I got some garlic and hot peppers that like I usually put in all my stuff. Like, you know, <laughs> that's how I rock and roll, mama. And I got the meat, I gotta cook that up. Probably put that in a pan, pan fry that. And I got the tortillas, and we'll throw them in the oven. Oh, yeah. The meal's coming together, mama. Oh, yeah. How real working, man, cook series. Oh yeah. I keep the skin on there so I keep them, you know, the meat moist. And probably pull all that meat off them bones and we'll uh, probably throw them in the pan fry and fry them a little bit. Nice and crispy. Nice and crispy, see? Oh yeah, mama. Oh yeah. Oh, you want some skin? Oh, 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 I think so. Oh, you want some, some tongue action? Let's see some tongue action. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's kind of hot, though. I don't know if you can do it. Let's let it cool a bit. Let's let it cool a bit. I'll give it to you. Oh, what? Let's let it cool a bit. I'll give it to you. Oh, what? Let's let it cool a bit, baby. Oh, yeah. What do you got going on there? You got diapers on? Proud master HVAC technician, are you in diapers? Huh? Oh, ho, ho, ho. the proud master HVAC technician's in diapers, mama. Oh, oh yeah. You're a proud master HVAC technician. Oh, yeah. I know you are. You got the pens for men's on, mama. Oh, yeah. That's a problem. Master HVAC technician's a leaker, mama. Oh, yeah, she is. You a problem, master? I reckon you all she's a problem, master HVAC technician. No. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. I got that little 12-inch pan here, so I'm going to get the steak going. You know I had it marinating in that miracle sauce. I don't know how it's gonna taste in that um the stuff I had marinating it, but we're gonna try it. Definitely different. You've seen the marinade stuff I use, so whatever. Stevie Lav answers to a different drum, mama. Oh yeah, he does. Alright guys, you see the steak going. I'm going to move it over to the other burner and get the, uh... Well, you've seen the marinade I had, so it's kind of like... Definitely a different marinade, man. We're going to see how it comes out. Oh, yeah. He's a real working man. Oh, yeah, he is. Next level, mama. All right, so I, guys, I put that um, give myself a, give myself a little bit here. Oh yeah. All right, so I had that, you know, Italian dressing in there and that um, that marinade. But this is kind of like a tough piece of steak, so we're gonna see how it comes out. I think it's gonna be fine. This is the baby dog, my buddy man.
kind of a tough piece of steak there, you know, bottom round type of steak. I got at the market. I got some stuff in the freezer from the um, from the, the troops overseas that's just frozen, so. And I got the chicken all, you know, pulled apart and cleaned up. Thigh meat. It's all ready to rock and roll. Oh, yeah. See all that caramelization there, all that, that brown stuff? We'll use that all with the vegetables in a little bit. Fajita meat, mama. Oh, yeah. Look at that stuff, guys. Huh? That's our real working man cook, man. That's our real working man cook. Cook this stuff up. We'll get it ready to rock and roll. You guys be calling me Julia Charles before you know it. I'll be the new Emerald Lagasse. Oh, yeah. Oh, mama. Oh, yeah. Steve's a new Emerald Lagasse, mama. Oh, yeah. What do you guys think? Next level, mama. Next level. Oh, yeah. Next level. Yeah. See all the caramel, caramelized, all that? Italian dressing. Oh yeah, man. We're good there. I'm ready to rock and roll. Do the vegetables next. What do you guys think? I think that worked out good, man. We'll have to try a piece, but I'm thinking it's going to be all caramelized. and Oh yeah. Alright guys, so I'm going to leave that right in there. We're going to throw, you know, the onions right in there. Red peppers, kind of a lot, and the green peppers. We'll get that all rendered down. It'll take a little while, I'll get back to you guys. Alright guys, I, I switched everything over from the, the 12 inch pan to the 14 inch pan because it was a little crowded and uh, we'll run to that down. I'll tell you this, this um this meat really came out great with that Italian dressing and the um, meat marinade. Man, this stuff is like really, really, really good. I, I think I tapped into something there with that um, Italian dressing. You really can't taste it now. Man, the meat's tender and really, really yummy. You really can't taste the Italian dressing in there at all. But it's the vinegar and all the seasoning that are kind of soaked into it. Really good. So let me kind of render this stuff all down. Give this a little... We'll get this rendered down a little bit, and then I'll throw the garlic and the hot peppers in there and some seasoning. Garlic and the hot peppers. I use this in a lot of my stuff, guys. I'm going to 
you know, put a little seasoning in there, a little pepper. Stuff's really smelling good, man. Oregano seasoning. Little doggy salt. Kind of a salt mix. You've got different stuff in there. It's really good stuff. You want to kind of get the garlic all mixed with the vegetables. And you want to still have a little bite with the vegetables. Oh, yeah. Can you hear that sizzle? Oh, yeah. Like I said, this is going to be quite a few meals here, so I ain't got a problem if I got extras. I'm a real worker, man. Cook, mama. You're a real worker, man, mama. Oh, yeah. That's looking good right there, guys. See that sizzle? Oh, yeah. Fajitas for everybody. Chicken, steak, fajitas, whatever you want. I'm just going to take some of these fajitas and throw them on a, a pan in the oven there and kind of get them a little I'll go with that for we'll put them in the oven there at 350 and we'll kind of bake them a little bit just to kind of crisp them off a little bit give them a little texture The old dog is doing the old tongue action, mama. Oh, yeah. Baby dog is getting hungry, man. Oh, yeah. Baby dog is doing some tongue action. Oh, yeah, she is. It's the baby dog, man. It's the baby dog. Step over, mama. Alright guys, I'm going to shut this off. This stuff's pretty much done. I don't want to have it, you know, I just kind of want to have it, um, you know, a little wimpy, but not overcooked. I want to have a little crunch to it, so I'm good with it. Just like that. Alright, I got my uh, fajitas out and they're all nice, you know, nice and warm. Tortillas, I should say. You know, like I said, this is kind of like, a, it's got a little, little snap to it yet, so that's the way we we'll want it right there. Alright okay, guys, so we got a tortilla here, just kind of nice and warm. We'll put some of our mix on there. This one will be a meat. We'll put some of the meat on there. Four cheese blend. Put a little bit of that on there. I'll get some of this mild sauce from Taco Bell. I like this stuff. For tacos. I'll put two on there. Oh yeah. What do you guys think? Alright guys, what do you think? 
that meat. Man, that meat's awesome. Yum. Man, that's good stuff. That's how a real working man cook right there, mama. Could have oozing out the back, man. Oh, yeah. Can't have that. Man, these are great. What, and you want some? Oh, you want some? Bong action? Oh, yeah, I think she wants some. Oh. What, you want some snack? You want some food? I think so. Alright guys, man. This is a... This thing is really, really good. Unbelievable. I'll get a chicken one together when I get you guys some shots. But man, this... this man, this steak one is like unbelievable. That steak there with that marinade and that um, Italian dressing... Kicked it out of the park. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. We're going to build a chicken one here. Let's see if we can build a chicken one. Bear with me. Some vegetables there. Some pieces of chicken. Man, that meat one was unbelievable. Some chicken on there. A little bit of cheese. And then the stuff from Taco Bell, man, this really makes a big difference. Mild sauce. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, Mama. Steve's a real worker, man. That's what you call a fajita right there. Look at that thing. Look at that baby. All right, Mama, you can see it's it's a real big one. Oh, yeah. Yum. Chicken fajita, mama. Oh, you want some? I think so. Unbelievable. I mean, that meat is like unbelievable. Marinated. Now, Italian dressing. We got marinade. Yum. And that was just, you know, cheap old, cheap old steak. That's all it was. Man. Canadian geese. Look at them all. <laughs> Stop the traffic. Walking across the road here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
the wall. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Come on, bitch, we ain't got all day here. <laughs> Come on, mama, you can do it, mama. You can do it, mama. <laughs> <laughs> 